Hi everybody, I'm Kim. Welcome to The Regretful Yarn Addict and My Chaotic Mess. Yay! <laughs> oh, like I didn't just redo this room a month ago, two months ago, whatever it was. Let me know if you're like that. If you have a specific room that you used for yarn or because like I do everything in this room. This is where I work at home and it's where I have my stash. It's where I, I actually sit here and I crochet right here at this desk. Usually I'm watching my laptop that's over there um, watching YouTube videos or the TV that you can't see. It's right behind you. I will watch a movie. Well, speaking of movies, a couple weekends ago, I watched Poor Things on Hulu. And, uh, wow, that was a weird movie, but I liked it. And then uh, I watched something else and I can't remember what it was. It was also, it was also on Hulu. It was a Nick Cage movie, The Retirement Plan. Yeah, that was pretty good too. So, um, you know, whatever. Um, yeah, so you guys, 1500. And as of this recording, and I'm recording this on Monday, April 22nd. You will see it on April 24th. Uh, I am like eight hours from reaching my 4,000 watch hours in the last 365 days. So I'm hoping that if at least 30 of you watch this video, by the end of the week, I'll have hit my 4,000 watch hours. Yay! And all the little goals will have been met. Um, yay. Also, um, before we're too far in, Deb Douglas, I would really appreciate it a whole lot if you would email me, please. So, I don't really have a lot that I made in the last week because I did get three or four stitch tutorials done this weekend. Uh, got some fun stitches coming up, you guys, in May. Yeah. Yeah, really. The last one I did, the one that's going to be, like, on the 25th of May, That that's a really fun little stitch. Okay, so, yeah, that's... That's, uh, that's what I've been up to, plus these couple things I'm going to show you. Also, I would like to ask that not only this video, but anytime that you're watching any YouTube video, and, um, you know, particularly the crochet-related ones, because, you know, that's our community. Make sure you watch the video from the start to the end until that screen pops up with all those little videos, that, you know, watch these. Um, because it, it, it does help a whole lot uh, for all of us. And, you know, I mean, any video you watch, not just crochet, you should, you should watch it from beginning to end, please. Uh, hit the like button, that little thumbs up, because that helps so much. It gets our videos out so other people can see them on their recommended page. And, uh, yeah, that's, yeah. And, uh, you know, be nice. Play nice. You're only hurting yourself. Well, that's not true. Because you're the other person too. So don't do it. Don't do it. You behave. 
don't make me get all mama on you. And especially don't make me go all grandma. Speaking of, hi Eli, hi Abe, hi Silas, hi Gideon, love you. Mwah, 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 mwah. Behave. Okay, so uh, have I babbled enough yet? Um, it's five minutes in. I could probably babble some more before I show you anything. But I won't. So if you saw the little, wait, let's babble some more. Because I want to thank everybody who has subscribed. You guys are awesome. I mean, totally awesome. And everyone who's been watching my videos and getting my watch overs up. Oh, fantastic. Great. You're super. Um, yeah. Wonderful. So very much appreciated. Okay. So, did you see the video I did where I was talking about the loopy yarn? I think I refer to it like as hand knitting. It's actually finger knitting. And I think I corrected myself in the description of that video. But in case I didn't, it's finger knitting. And I did, I did get it done. My whip. And you have no idea what that is. But hopefully next week you'll find out. So my imperfect, totally flawed blanket made with Burnett Alizé. It has so many mistakes in it. I don't even want to hear about how many mistakes it has. I mean, it is just full of one mistake after another. And you know what? That's fine. I'm not trying to win any awards with it. I'm not trying to impress anybody. I'm definitely not going to sell it. This will be just one of those blankets I throw in the ottoman because we have this rectangular ottoman that the dog thinks is another one of her beds. And you can see her, she's sleeping right there. Well, you can just see her butt. But anyway, it's this big ottoman and it has storage. And that's where this will go. All right, now, the next thing I'm going to show you I saw this uh, tutorial when I was scrolling through, you know, no so amigurumi. And it is no sew. There's absolutely no sewing. I mean, except for when you sew up the, the finishing hole, but otherwise there is no sewing in this. Um, I think they're adorable. I... I would say make one. I would, I don't know if I'd say make six because the one part just takes forever. So, and this is the only one that I have sewed the ends in on. But look, the little hedgehog. This part, the body, boom, I made six bodies in like an hour and a half. That part was super easy. This part, uh, because these little spikes, you put your hook through the body and then you chain up while you do your slip stitch chain up four, make three single crochets, slip stitch, chain up four, make three singles. And I swear to God, there's a million of them. But they're so cute. You know what though? 
just the body. Um, if you put ears on it and a little tail, they would make adorable little um, otters. But this is a hedgehog. See, and I have a tail I have to sew in. And this is another one. All of these were made with um, Premier Basics chenille. This yarn is Burnett Blanket, but it's a, a smaller yarn. It's Yeah, it's about the same size as the basic chenille. But anyway, there's this one. And this one. See, sometimes the faces got turned and I don't know why, because I made them all the exact same, with the same hook, same tension, same number of everything, but I don't know. So this one is kind of looking to the side, because there's the front legs and the bottom legs. And he's just, and a couple of them are like that. Gotta sew in that end. Okay, this one is also turned, but this yarn, this is the same yarn. It's Chanel Basics, but it just, uh, it's gotta be the black dye they use because it just came out thicker and stiffer than the others. And you're supposed to, okay, you're supposed to start like in the middle of the head and then you go around the body and then you just do a spiral. And this one, I was like, well, I'm going to start here and go out instead of going in. Don't do that. Just, just don't. Trust me. I thought it would be easier and it wasn't. And I just feel like I've got 2 million spikes on this one. And then I have this one. See, most of their heads got turned. I don't... Maybe they just thought something was more interesting off to the side. I don't know. And then I made this one. That head is turned as well, but and it's stupid because you don't sew the head on. It's all it's all one piece. This is all one. You start up here. No, you start up here, and you go up, and you finish, and then you just add these on. This was the last one I made and I think I finally got the hang of it because this one doesn't seem to be, it still has, you know, 800,000 stitches, uh, spikes instead of a million, but it was just easier to do. So those I got done. <coughs> and that, is a tutorial by Annie Taguchi, A-N-I Taguchi, Taguchi. I will put it down below so that you all can go make yourself a cute little hedgehog. I always thought I'd love to have a real hedgehog. Um, I've always thought I'd like to have a lot of things. And in theory, in theory, I would have all the animals. In reality, 
two dogs and three cats in this house is one dog and three cats too many. Just saying. Um, yeah. So, you guys, this is episode 63. And I'm going to make a confession. This year, I will be 63. So, because this is just a couple weeks away from my birthday, and we've hit 1,500, um, I'm doing a giveaway in this video. Okay? Uh, it's going to start today, April 24th. It will run until May 1st, probably May 1st is a weekday. I'm going to say 9 p.m. I'll probably remember to end it and draw a winner. Uh, May 2nd, I will announce the winner and you will have until my birthday. May 9th to contact me. Uh, you have to be 18 years or older and a resident of the United States or have a U.S. post office box, whatever. As long as I can mail it to somewhere in the United States. And to make it fair, uh, and this is going to be a rule I'm going to have on all my giveaways from now on. You can't have won anything from this channel in the last 30 days. So, you know, we want to make sure everybody gets a chance. Uh, all right. So, I'm thinking this might be the last subscriber count video I do until I hit 5,000. If I hit 5,000 before December 30th. And we all know, I've already said, that one I will be giving away a $100 gift certificate to Hobby, H-O-B-B-I-I. -I, uh, if we reach 5,000 before December 30th. If it's after December 30th, then I'll do something else. But there will be a giveaway at 5,000. It just won't be that. So, for this giveaway, you're getting stitch markers that I made. Little ladybugs. A little shawl pin of a yarn cupcake. A size H8 5mm crochet hook. These work very nice. I I do like these. Some wool needles with the little loopy thing. If you've never used those, they're really nice, especially when you're using thicker yarn. So you'll get these. A to-do list that should say Crochet, 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 crochet. And you can't have a to-do list without a pen. And then a Notion pouch. Do more of what makes you awesome because you all are awesome. And now what everybody really wants, yarn. Okay. Before I show it to you, I'm going to say this. This is yarn that I think I got in a mystery box a few years ago. I thought I would make something with it. It came in Hank style, but I caked it all up because, like I said, I thought I was going to make something with it. And then I could never find a pattern I liked. So this is... Bamboo Bloom Hand Paints. I do believe there's one, two, three, four, 
it looks like there was five skeins of each color and you're getting both it's 100 grams 154 yards in each uh each hank skein whatever it says it's a bulky but it's actually a roving it's 48 percent rayon from bamboo 44 percent wool eight percent acrylic uh, one of these colors is Kabuki. I think it's, I think Kabuki is the blue. So this is it. Very pretty yarn, but it's definitely roving. I mean, you've got some thick parts and then some thin parts. I don't know if they tell you what size hook to use or needle or anything. It's made in Turkey. Hand wash, lay flat to dry because it has wool. Uh, okay. So anyway, there's... this and then what is this color okay this is kabuki the blue is Reflect, reflecting pool. This is reflecting pool. This is Kabuki. And five of these. So, and I have the little labels tucked into each cake. So that's the giveaway. You get 10 cakes, 10 cakes of yarn, and all the little doodads. And all you have to do to be entered comment any comment but it has to be words it can't just be uh, emojis because I don't think the comment picker picks up emojis I think it has you have to have words in it so yeah uh, and please don't say anything about giveaway because I would like to keep this for subscribers since the subscribers are the reason that I hit 1500 so we don't want somebody just walking in off the street and saying oh I want that and not be a subscriber I mean that would suck and we haven't done this in a minute so I'm just shuffling my little cards to see what our uh, mystical advice. I just think this is fun. So, here we go. Attend to the details. The details are if you'd like to win this giveaway that I'm not mentioning and you're not going to mention then attend to the details 
Oh, I like this one too. The bottom one says, push through any insecurity. So attend to the details and push through any insecurity. Now, come on, that's pretty good advice. Oh, girl, you are. So, I would like to thank you all. Sorry, I just got a phone call coming through. Um, it's my sister. I'll call her back. <clears throat> Again, I want to thank you all. Don't forget, it's a giveaway, but don't say it's a giveaway. If I see the word giveaway down there, I will delete it. So, yeah, just comment on anything. You can talk about the weather. You can talk about the hedgehogs. You can talk about the loopy blanket. You can talk about my dog that you can't see because now she's laying on the rug. That is, oh, it was such a pretty rug when I put it down, and now it's gray and pink. I had my son bring over my, my shampoo, so I'm going to try to clean it. So babble, babble, blah, blah. Thank you all for watching. If you are not subscribed, please do. Oh, and speaking of giveaways, if anybody's out there and you have a podcast, um, you have a channel that you actually create content for and you're putting out videos uh, and you would like to do a collaboration swap with me like Christina at Bella Uncinetto and I did last month, well, earlier this month, email me and let me know because that was fun. I enjoyed that. And, uh, you know, let's help each other out. So I don't care how many subscribers you have, as long as you have like at least 100. I want to see that you're at least trying. Or if you've got 100,000 and you still want to do it, that's fine. If you want to do a collaboration swap with me, watch that video so you know what they are and uh, email me because they're a lot of fun. And otherwise, y'all have a good day, good morning, good evening, whatever, whenever, where, whatever it is when you're watching. I think I lost a word in there. And later, Gators. Peace out.